everyone, it's me, Crazy Mario Bros, and this is the 500,000 subscribers Q&A. After a few months of waiting, it's finally here for you to enjoy. Before we get into it, make sure you subscribe to our channel since this video is a celebration of us hitting 500,000 subscribers and we're trying to hit 600,000 before the summer. And we need all of your help to get there in time. Also, make sure to like this video. Let's try to get it to 50,000 likes since, you know, 50,000 is one-tenth of 500,000, so it feels kind of fitting. And with that out of the way, enjoy the special! I can't believe you. Why won't you just let me be happy for once? Why would you do this to me? All I wanted to do today was relax and enjoy myself. And you won't even let me have that! You always have to take my happiness away from me whenever I least expect it and whenever I need it most. So you know what? I wish some of the worst of the worst crimes to happen to you. Because if I can't have my happiness, then no one can have their happiness. Uh... Dad? <laughs> uh, hey, Junior, what's going on? Uh, who are you talking to? Oh, I wasn't really talking to anybody, but I am really angry at whoever our internet provider is shutting off YouTube for no reason. What is wrong with them? Wait, wait, YouTube is down? Like, we can't watch any YouTube videos? No, Junior, we can't watch any YouTube videos because for some reason, YouTube is suddenly down right when I was about to watch it. Like, look at this baloney. <laughs> YouTube is down here. Yeah, like, I'm supposed to believe that. This is clearly some kind of an attack on us. Hmm, I don't know, Dad. Maybe it's just your internet connection. Let's go see if anyone else is dealing with this. Okay, but I guarantee you that they're not. Oh, God, stupid cyber attacks. Oh, come on, just work already. What is wrong with this? Oh, God, why won't this work? Uh, what's going on, Madio? <sighs> Nothing, Luigi. It's just all I'm trying to do is watch some YouTube, but it says, oh, YouTube is down, and it won't even let me watch anything. God, I hate it. Well, wait, YouTube is down? What do you think caused that? I don't know, but hopefully I find out who's responsible for this soon, because I swear, once I find out who did this, I'm gonna hurt them very, very badly. In Minecraft. On peaceful mode. Uh, guys, can I talk to you about something? Yeah, me too. I'm also here. I just figured I'd insert myself. Oh, hey guys, not right now. We're trying to figure out why our YouTube won't work. I was just about to watch some videos, and then it says YouTube is down? Like, how does this even happen? Boy, well, your YouTube doesn't work? Well, neither does ours. We can't figure out what's going on. Yeah, we don't know how long ours has been out for. We just found out about it. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with the people behind the was that? Uh, I don't know, but I have no idea what you just said. Yeah, me neither. You just sounded like an Xbox party chat for a second. Uh, well, that was weird. Anyways, as I was saying, I think it has something to do with the people. Hello? What are you doing? Whoa, what is this Rubik's Cube doing here? Uh, I don't know, but I also don't know how to solve a Rubik's Cube, so I don't know what we're supposed to do with this. So what do you guys think? Should I try to solve it? Man, I say you just throw it in the trash. There's no point in having it if you can't solve it. Yeah, I guess you're right. All right, get out of here, stupid Rubik's Cube. <laughs> Whoa, 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 what was that? Yeah, are you okay, Matteo? Uh, I don't know, but my phone hurts pretty badly, though. Initiating Q&A sequence. W initiating Q&A? What does that mean? Q&A? Hmm. <gasps> oh, yeah, were we supposed to do one of those, like, a couple months ago? I don't know, I think so, but I already forgot about that, and I think the fans forgot about it, too. Oh, I didn't know everyone was here. Uh, okay, so how exactly is this gonna work? Like, like, is a question just gonna appear at the bottom, or... What do I think of Chris Pratt as Mario? Well, okay, first of all, no. Second of all, he is a phony, he is a copycat, and he is a liar. He will never be me, and I promise you, I do not approve of him being me in the Mario movie. But, I don't really have any control in it either, it's Nintendo's decision, so... <sighs> Looks like we'll never get my justice. But no, I don't approve of Chris Pratt being me, okay? I don't even know who he is. Oh no, I don't like remembering this story. Alright guys, I'm just gonna give you a warning, okay? I'm about to get into some really traumatic stuff from my childhood, okay? So, so just a warning. Okay, so once upon a time, when I was way younger, I was a wee little lad, and I was sleeping in my bed, probably dreaming about, like, uh, pancakes or what cartoon I was gonna watch in the morning, I don't know. But, I was sleeping, and then all of a sudden, this knock was at the door, but I was asleep, so I couldn't hear it. And then, the door was creaking open. Now, I don't know why the knock didn't wake me up, but the creak did. So I was up in my bed, and then I looked at the doorway, and I saw... Aunt Jemima in the doorway! No, it wasn't actually her, it was the bottle. This is why I'm scared of the bottle. But basically, the bottle started running up to me, and it jumped on my face, and it started eating my face, and it was just so scary! Uh, Luigi, I think you need some counseling, because that never happened. So come with me, Luigi, we're gonna go get you a counselor. Oh, come on, man, you don't take me to a counselor, I swear it happened! Uh, okay, I wonder what my question is. 
Oh, I love this question. I can answer this question perfectly. Okay, so my most favorite food in the entire world is lobster. And the reason for that is because one time we went to a seafood restaurant and I had lobster and it was so good. It's so juicy. It's so red. It's so uh, sea-like. I don't know. But it was really good. I really loved it. Junior, we've never been to a seafood restaurant. What do you mean, Dad? I thought we did go to a seafood restaurant. You know, that's where I had the lobster. No, Junior, you've never had lobster and we've never been to a seafood restaurant. And the reason for that is because technically we're turtles and there's such thing as a sea turtle, so it almost be kind of cannibalism if we had seafood. Uh, but we aren't sea turtles. Hey, don't question my parenting methods, Okay, I'm a perfect father. I know exactly what's best for my children. Now, what is my question? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember the names of my seven children. Uh, does that count Junior? Uh, no, I think they're talking about the Kooplings. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, right, right, right. Uh, the Kooplings. Um, okay. Okay, so there's, uh, isn't there that one named, like, uh, Bob? Yeah, so much for perfect father, huh? Hey, shut up, Junior! Whoa, I don't want to be part of their argument. Okay, what's my question? Wait. What? Is he actually my mother? Luigi! Luigi, get back in here! Alright, Yoshi, perfect timing. Here's Luigi back. We couldn't even get in the car without him breaking a window. He really doesn't want to go to that counselor. Uh, yeah, obviously I don't want to go to that counselor. I don't need a counselor. That story actually happened. Anyways, what's up, Yoshi? Well, the question that I got says that you're actually my mama, so I was just wondering if that's true. Uh, I mean, not that I know of. We don't really look that alike. I mean, you're a whole different species than me, so I don't know how it could be your mama. I mean, if you think about it, you guys are both green, so there is some kind of a correlation. Well, yeah. Yeah, that's just because I'm wearing green clothes. I'm not actually green when I take off my clothes. Luigi, Luigi, I really want to find out whether or not this is actually true because if the comments say it, then it must be true. So let's go to the hospital and get a DNA test. But, but, but that's not even necessary. Like, you're literally a dinosaur. Come on, Luigi. We got to go to the hospital. We got to answer this person's question. But, but that's not necessary, though. It's so obvious. Ugh, God, this is so weird. Well, I guess I'm about to take the weirdest DNA test of my life. Let's do this. <laughs> Matthew, this is the most ridiculous thing we've ever done. Oh, come on, Luigi, don't be silly. You ordering pizza with anchovies is the craziest thing we've ever done. And the grossest, because that's literally disgusting. Luigi, we gotta do what the comments say. That's what this video's about. Okay, how many times do I have to state that this whole situation about me being Yoshi's mama makes no sense because I'm literally a man? Oh, welcome, patients. Good to be working with you today. So, I uh, hear we're gonna be doing some DNA tests? That is correct. Here to see if these two are blood-related or not. Uh, how could they be blood related? They're not the same species. That's what I've been trying to say! Look, I don't know, okay? It wasn't my idea. Can you just do the DNA test? Uh, okay, will do. Or, will try, I guess. Okay, so for the first part of this DNA test... Ah, what the heck are we doing with that thing? Yeah, I'm not gonna let you stab my brother with that! <laughs> oh man, classic doctor jokes. Okay, but we don't actually use a syringe for these. We usually use a DNA sample, so let me go get the cup. Okay, I'm gonna need both of you to spit in this cup. Trust me, I know it sounds weird, but that's just how it works. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, aren't you supposed to use a different... Uh, you know what, never mind. Uh, Alright, there you go. Okay, time to take this to the back and see what we get. You know, Luigi, I'm starting to really feel like you're not actually my mama. Yeah, glad we can finally see eye to eye on something. But you guys are both green, though. I mean, wouldn't it just make sense if he was your mama? Matthew, just because I'm green does not mean that I'm automatically his mama! Uh, guys, the results are ready. Okay, now in my hands right here, I have the results for the DNA test. Now I know this might be a lot for you guys to take in, but I promise you that everything will be okay. Okay, so Luigi, you are not the mother! Yes! Oh my god, that's exactly what I was trying to tell you guys! Oh man, I feel so smart right now. That doesn't make any sense though, he's literally great. <sighs> Oh, whatever. We'll figure this out later. Well, I guess I'm glad we cleared up that rumor. Thanks for your help, doctor. Yeah, yeah, guys. No problem. Come back anytime. Oh, wait a minute. I wasn't supposed to mix up their DNA. I was supposed to put them in two separate samples. So, so the test is wrong. Fuck! Well, that was weird. Anyways, to answer your question, he's not actually my mom, so I don't have any feelings on it. But if he was my mom, then I'd actually be very surprised because me and him have very different IQs, if you know what I mean. Oh, that's easy. You want to know my daily routine? It's not even that hard to follow. It's even got its own rhythm to it. Okay, so I wake up, I go to work, I go home, and then I go to sleep, and then I wake up, and then I go to work, and then I go home, and then I go to sleep, I wake up, I go to work, I go home, I go to sleep, I wake up, I go to work, I go home, I go to sleep, I wake up, I go to work. Hopefully that'll put him out of his misery. Why am I not in that many videos? I'm gonna be completely honest, sometimes I just like disappearing. You know, it's kind of funny to see people wonder where I went. Speaking of which, see ya! And I can confirm that, he really does like to disappear for no reason. I don't know why he does it, it's so weird. Okay, if you want me to give you the completely honest answer, it's okay because of all the attention I get. I mean, that kind of makes up for it, but 
I don't know. I mean, for how big I am in the world, I don't really get paid enough. Like, I shouldn't really be living in this type of house for how big I am in the world. Like, don't get me wrong, it's not a bad house, but, you know, I'm one of the biggest video game stars in the world, so Nintendo doesn't really pay me enough. Like, you know, I should be living in my own, like, million dollar mansion or something. I don't know. I mean, it's got its goods and bads, but it's not the worst. I mean, I'm still living with my friends, and that's fine with me. Oh, come on! I just got over that story, and now you guys are reminding me of it again? Okay, anyways, I already kind of answered this question earlier, but yeah, it was like when I was a wet little kid, and you know, she did that stuff to me, so yeah, it's pretty messed up. Whoa, 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 wait, don't tell me this question is about that weird story you just told. Well, uh, no, 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 it's not, man, yo, it's not about that story, I already got over that story, you know, you don't have to call the counselor. Okay, good, don't tell that story again, you're gonna weird out the viewers, because it didn't happen. Uh, yeah, 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 sure, sure, it, it didn't, it, it didn't happen, it, it totally didn't happen. Oh, we didn't make Larry that way. He's kind of always been like that. Like, whenever I first met him, he was trying to act all normal around me so I wouldn't judge him, but after a while, he slowly showed that he's kind of going through a tough time. So, uh, yeah, he's always kind of been like that. W what? What are you talking about? I'm not big and round. That's not true. I mean, look at me. See, like, I'm very in shape, you know, I'm very good looking, and I have a gym membership. So, you know, I go to the gym all the time. Dad, you have a gym membership? Well, yeah, yeah, I do. I swear I have it. It's downstairs. And how many times have you used it? I mean, I used the card as a back scratcher one time. Dad, I'm talking about how many times have you used the card at the gym. Like, how many times have you gone to the gym? Okay, do you want to get grounded today or what? Uh, no, sir. Eh, yeah, he does do that. And at first it kind of hurt, but after a while, I started to kind of get used to his crazy weight. Okay, Yoshi, I don't actually weigh that much. Mario, one time I could literally feel my spine about to snap when you were riding me. Uh, well, maybe you just didn't get enough sleep or something, you know? Maybe you slept in a weird position. What? Oh yeah, I've caught a lot of people with past charges, especially someone who's in this room right now. Because for some reason, this kid is always getting into so much trouble. I catch him like literally every week. What are you talking about? What crimes could I possibly have committed? I barely even go outside and my friends always tell me to touch grass. You don't go outside. What are you talking about? I literally always catch you. Wait a minute. <gasps> oh, you don't actually look that much like that guy. Do you know someone that looks just like you, but he has, like, pink glasses? Uh, you mean my brother Roy? Yeah, 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 that's probably him. Sorry, I got you guys confused. You guys are both kind of fat, so I couldn't really see the difference. Well, I didn't know this turned from a Q&A to a freaking roast battle. So you know what? I guess I'm gonna go next. You see those shoes right there? Where did you get those? A school lost and found? They look so weird. They look like a second grader wears them. Like, you're a full-grown adult, and you're wearing purple shoes? Like, oh my god. The, the school lost and found? Really? Jesus, we suck at making family-friendly roasts. Nope! Okay, I'm gonna be completely honest. As many problems as I have with Luigi, he is my brother, so I kind of need him. You know, siblings need each other, so I can't really imagine life without Luigi. What would I be doing? Well, at least I wouldn't be having someone who reminds me how smart I am. Hey! <gasps> oh, if I was on an island, which three items I would take? Okay, okay, so this is gonna be a fun one. So the first item I would take is Madio, and then I would take Junior, and then I would take Bowser, and it would be the most fun island in the world with all of my friends. L Luigi, are you serious? Why? It'd be all of my friends on an island. Yeah, but like, if it's a stranded island, then like, why would you want to drag us into your crappy situation? Well, yeah, like, how are we supposed to escape? Yeah, I don't know anything about survival. Oh yeah, that actually is a good question. Hey, uh, post in the comment, whoever commented that, uh, can you answer whether or not it's a stranded island? Like, is it like a vacation island, or is it like, like a stranded one where we can't get off? Uh, yeah, I actually do still have my PS4 in the other room, however... Personally, I play my PS5 a lot more than I play my PS4. Sorry, PS4, but there's just no competition here. Let me know what you guys think in the comments, whether you think the PS4 or the PS5 is better. Maybe you can change my mind. Okay, first of all, what in the world is an Oculus? Is that some kind of a sea animal? And second of all, yeah, he actually has spent all my money on my credit card before. Well, when did I do that? Junior, you really don't remember when they released mine coins on Minecraft and you just bought a bunch of mine coins with my credit card? Oh, yeah. Yeah, those were a total ripoff. Yeah, I agree. Oh, you bet I do. I love the taste of bread. Ah, <sighs> man, the things I do to live in a world only inhabited by bread. I mean, just look at it. Everything about it is so perfect. The perfect shape and size. You can either eat all at once and absorb all of the flavor, or take your time and savor it all. And the crust. Oh my god, it depends what mood you're in, but sometimes this stuff is really, really good. Yoshi? Huh? Dude, what are you doing? Uh, I was about to make myself a sandwich? Uh-huh, you should probably get to that right after your little makeout session. Man, this house is weird. 
<laughs> uh, I mean, I probably could try. I wouldn't really like it, though. Hello there, I am the police. You might know who I am, everybody does. But, have you ever wanted to have a very new experience, not in a good way? Have you ever wanted to have a drink so disgusting that it makes your intestines almost pop? Do you want to have heart palpitations years before you're supposed to? Well then, I have the drink for you. Introducing whatever this thing is. It is literally so disgusting that it is guaranteed to give you at least some sort of side effect. So if you're a pain freak like me, it totally Wrong. Make sure you don't forget to pick up this bottle of toxic waste. I mean, uh, whatever this thing is, and I hope you have a good day. Oh, man, I was just speaking truth right there. I am not currently allowed to answer that question at this time. Please try your question again in the near future. And as for my least favorite Mario Kart track, it'd have to be the most obvious one of all. It's Toad's Turnpike. I hate Toad's Turnpike. That has to be one of the hardest and most annoying Mario Kart tracks in the entire world. And here's why. Especially if you play it on Mario Kart 64. Because there's these little buses, you know? It's that course where, you know, it's a bunch of roads. There's like roads looping around. And it's got buses driving on them. And those buses are so impossible to avoid. Especially with the broken physics of Mario Kart 64. Now I know Mario Kart 64 is an old game and I shouldn't be judging it, but you know, but why would they even put Toad's Turnpike in it when it's so hard to do? I swear, one time I was playing Toad's Turnpike on Mario Kart 64 and it took me 14 minutes to beat it! Like three, it took me 14 minutes to beat three laps. So you know what? Toad's Turnpike is my very least favorite course because it's just too hard, okay? The broken physics, the buses, they're really hard to dodge and I gotta hate it. You know, Matthew, I think we need to get you some counseling. No, Luigi, I don't think I'm the one that needs counseling. I think Nintendo actually needs some counseling so they never make a course like Toad's Turnpike again. It's just, God, it's so hard. Uh, hey Mario, you have another question so you might want to answer it. Oh yeah, sorry Junior. All right, let's see what this question is. Way? How much do I- Way? Uh, I don't know what you mean by way, but, uh, if you're asking me what way I'm looking, then I'm looking this way. I'm looking this way at the awesome viewer that's watching this video right now. Thank you very much, we appreciate you. Oh, this will be fun to find out. Okay, Luigi, now we have this tape measure so we can see how high you can jump, okay? Just try your best. Uh, okay. Ah. No, Luigi, actually try your best. I know you can jump higher than that. <sighs> okay. Ah. Ow, 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 how was that? Uh, looks like it was about 25 inches. Good job, Luigi. Now, uh, how do I get down? Uh, I don't know. That's not my problem. Boy, no, Luigi, come back! <sighs> okay, whatever. I can just try something else. Uh, maybe I can, like, lean over this. What? Work at Five Nights at Freddy's for, for minimum wage? Uh, no, I wouldn't do that, especially not for minimum wage, because I already have my own job. Junior, you have a job? What job do you have? Well, my job is to flex on these haters! Hey! You know what I mean, Dad? Junior, I hope you got a splinter in your eye. Oh, you bet it is! I love wearing my sombrero hat. It's so awesome. Let me go get it. Oh, yeah! Uh, oh my god, is that Sabrero Bowser? Uh, hey, Sabrero Bowser, can I get an autograph? Oh, wait, Dad put on a Sabrero! Oh my god, I cannot compete with the coolness of that! Yeah, I mean, look at how cool this Sabrero is! I mean, it's got so many colors on it, it perfectly matches his outfit, it's pretty cool! Yes, it is my favorite thing to wear. Uh, oh. Yeah, you're not cool anymore, you're only cool when you have the Sabrero. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 I totally still have the restaurant, uh, let me show you guys how it's doing. Okay, guys, now I know it's been a long time since you guys have seen the restaurant, I know, I know, it went kind of silent, but I assure you that it's still going strong. So we're in front of the restaurant today, and I'm going to be walking in and showing you guys how it's doing. So let's go. Those are my footsteps. Okay, guys, so here is the inside of the restaurant. Now, as you can see, it's doing extremely well. There are so many people in here. I have no idea who this guy is on the TV, but but I assure you that there are a lot of people here and that it's doing super well. Now, now let's go to the back and we'll show you how it's made, okay? Now, I did have to hire a few workers, but it's okay because the food is still top notch. <laughs> Okay, guys, now, as you can see, this is our kitchen full of hard-working chefs. Now, I promise you uh, that I picked these chefs with, uh, w uh, w with quality. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I have to admit the truth. I really didn't want to tell you guys this, but, okay, we had to file for bankruptcy, and my apartment complex got really mad because of how many customers we had coming, so we had to shut down, and we ran out of money, and... 
<sighs> yeah, I didn't really want to tell you guys. Uh, this is really embarrassing. Oh, and, and if you hear any rumors about there being hair in someone's food, that is completely untrue, okay? That is not the reason why we shut down. That uh, that, is, that, that is not the reason. Oh, God, I don't like remembering this one. It's really scary, but I'll try to sum it up, okay? Okay, so one time, we got a noise complaint on our phone, and they were saying that their neighbors are partying way too loud, way too late at night. So we decided, you know what, we're gonna go investigate. Why not? We have nothing to do. So we decided to go out and go to that neighbor's house, and then we barged on the door. We're like, hey, 911's here. We got a noise complaint. But it turned out there was no such party going on. No, no, no. It was quite a murder party, if anything, because... They were playing Yahtzee, and Yahtzee is like the most boring game in the world. So like, how, how can people even play that, you know? It was scary how many people were playing it. It was a family of six, six people were playing Yahtzee. How is that even possible? Uh, oh my God, but that does sound really scary. Why would anyone want to play Yahtzee? Exactly, kid. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Who could we all beat in a fight? All right, then let's go one by one. Personally, I think I could beat Ash Ketchup in a fight. He doesn't really seem that intimidating. He's a little kid. I think I could beat Tony the Tiger in a fight. I think I could beat Mike Tyson in a fight. Luigi, Mike Tyson's not a fictional character. I think I could beat NES Mike Tyson in a fight. I think I could beat Santa Claus in a fight. Because, well, well, Dad, actually, I think that'd be a pretty even fight, judging by the way your body looks. Okay, get over here, Junior! I don't think I could beat anybody. I'm pretty weak. I think I could beat anybody that I want to because I'm a cop and I went to training for that. But could you beat Goku, though? That's the question. Yeah, I could beat Goku! Yeah, don't push your luck. Uh, have I ever wanted to kick someone out? No, I've never really wanted to kick someone out myself, unlike some people here. Hey, Maggie, we had a good reason to kick you out, and you know that. Uh, whatever, Luigi, whatever. You don't know what goes on in my life. Oh my god. The pain never goes away. Mario, we're not in middle school anymore. You're a grown man. Hey, I can be young and hip too, you know, right? My my boys, my gamers, you know? Maddie will stop. Uh, I'd probably have to go with watching paint dry for a day since that's the shortest amount of time. And plus, I like paint anyway. Okay, then go do it. Wait, wait you actually want me to go do it? Yeah, go do it. If you really think you can do it, then go do it. Uh, okay, then I'll go do it. Okay, I guess I'm gonna be watching paint dry now. Uh, so do I do. Hey, Luigi, how you do? Oh, you're actually doing it, huh? Well, well, at least you're actually doing it. That's good. You're a man of your word. All right, Luigi, I'll leave it to you, buddy. Good luck. Please kill me. Oh, you really think I've already went through puberty? Well, that's a compliment. But no, this is actually just my baby voice. I mean, I can try to get my real voice out. <coughs> yeah, I'm not who you think I am. Stay off my bad side. <laughs> that's the easiest thing you guys have asked me to do so far. I'm not afraid of no bears. Come out and get me if you dare. I'm right here. Bowser's ready. What? Hello? Huh. It doesn't look like there's anyone out here. Uh, what's that? Uh, 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 oh, thank goodness! I thought I heard a voice out here. Uh, oh my god! It's a bear! Run! Oh no no no! I'm a raccoon! I'm a raccoon! Uh, you know what? Whatever. <sighs> okay. You know what? I've decided. I am not dealing with a bear today. That is not what I signed up for. Even though it is, but I don't want to handle a bear. Okay? Those things are way too scary. Well, let's see if I can find anything out. Aww, there's a cute little doggy down there. Well, hey, doggy, you want to fight? I'm not scared of you. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you think you're so tough? Well, then take on a brawl with me, buddy! <laughs> you know, if you were a tough dog, you would've hit me already. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god get off me! Oh my god, it hurts! Jesus, Bowser, you need to learn some self-defense. Okay, come on, why do you guys keep bringing that up? <laughs> Where's a place we all want to live at? Uh, well, I know it's a basic choice, but I kind of want to live in Hawaii. I want to live in Texas. It's so big. There's so many places to go. It's just, it's awesome. I want to go to the beach and live in a sandcastle. If only that was possible. I mean, at least you don't have to pay rent. I want to live in the Bahamas because the name sounds like banana. It's like the bananas, the Bahamas. It's just, I love bananas. Jeez, you guys are all unoriginal. You're either picking islands or beaches. I want to live in Florida. I like the sun. And I would want to live right where I'm living right now because I'm with all of my friends and I wouldn't want to change a single thing about my life. Dude, that is literally the lamest f***ing thing you could have ever said. Like, that's the lamest answer ever. Anyways, as for the Truth or Dare thing, if you want the answer to that, then after you're done with this video, go watch Truth or Dare 5 and watch the ending. It'll explain everything. Uh, probably about, like, one or two times. Wait, what are we talking about? 
Or we could get a live answer for this. Wait, wait, wait. Where are you taking me? <gasps> Ooh, we're back in here? So what are we doing? What's the occasion? <sighs> well, if I'm being honest, I didn't really want to do this, but it's what the comments says, so... Okay, Luigi, let's find out how many hits it takes till you get knocked out. <clears throat> Really? You think I'm that weak? You know what? Hand me the boxing glove. I have an idea. Uh, okay. Here you go. Ah, thanks. All right, now let's see how many hits it takes to knock you out. Ah! Wait, what? Oh, you bet I have some wicked dance moves. All right, guys. Allow me to demonstrate. <gasps> Wow, I didn't know he was that talented at dancing. Good for you, Luigi. I am back from the grave. Uh, it kind of sucks, if I'm being honest. Yeah, for some reason, we barely even see any of our other siblings anymore. They just keep leaving for some reason. I don't know. I think they just go out and party or something. The only person that actually stays is Iggy because he has no life. Yeah, I can vouch for that. I really don't. Well, yeah, I can survive a manhunt. Who do you think I am? Okay, Bowser, we have a circle of defense around you. As soon as you leave that circle, we're gonna start hunting after you, okay? Uh, I don't know, Mario. I mean, that seems kind of unfair, you know? Like, there's five of you, and there's one of me, and I don't know if it would really be that fair with how many of you there are if you just started instantly, you know? Can I get a one-minute head start? You want a head start? Uh, okay, we can do a one-minute head start. Okay, Bowser, one-minute head start as soon as you leave. Fine by me. Uh, I guess I'm gonna get going now. <laughs> oh, he's gonna be toast by the time we catch him. Exactly! He just doesn't know what's coming for him. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Tripped on my foot! <laughs> Dude, he's literally so slow that not even the head start's gonna help him. Yeah, this is definitely the wrong type of person to get for a game about running. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Bowser, you gotta hide somewhere, because you're getting tired. Okay, where should you hide? Uh, no, I'm not hiding in the oven again, not after last time. Uh, I can hide in here! <laughs> okay, okay, all right. Okay, guys, I'm ready. Come and find me. And one minute, let's go. <laughs> don't ever find me. Hey, Junior, <laughs> you don't see me, right? <laughs> oh, come on, Junior. I thought I picked a good hiding spot. Dad, you literally hid right in front of us. That's how slow you are. Oh, man, I thought I was going to win that. That's going to TMZ. Well, that was brutal. Anyways, I've already talked about this question of the scariest crime I've ever solved. It was that Yahtzee game. I don't know why anyone plays Yahtzee. If you actually like Yahtzee, then comment down below. Uh, what do we plan on doing at a million? Well, personally, once we hit a million subscribers, if we ever do, which, I mean, you could subscribe and you could help us hit it faster, then we're probably planning... I, I don't know what just happened, but anyways, we're probably planning on doing... You know what, never mind. Uh, we don't really know right now. I don't know what's going on, but we don't really know what we're doing yet. So just subscribe so we can figure it out faster. Uh, well, first of all, I don't think he's dumb. He is dumb. And if it came to his IQ, then it'd probably be in the way negatives, like way down there in the millions. Luigi, there's no coming back from this. Wait, what are we talking about? Yeah, it's probably better that you don't know. So good job, buddy. Oh no, not the scariest movie I've ever seen. Okay, okay, I'll try to sum this up, okay? Because I know you guys didn't really like my last scary story, but I'll try and tell it. Okay, so there was a movie where there was a dog, and then there was another dog, and they really didn't like each other. And then what happened was, one of the dogs got lost, and so the other dog had to take all their other dog friends, and they had to go and find the dog. And you know, I really love dogs, so I didn't like knowing that a dog was missing, and you know, it was just so many scary things going on while they were trying to find the other dog, and it was the scariest horror movie ever. Are you talking about the secret life of pets? What? Uh, no, no, I'm not talking about the secret life of pets. Guys, get off my back! <laughs> Scaredy cat! Do we plan on introducing new characters? Uh, yeah, we're probably gonna introduce- Uh... Okay, I don't know why that keeps on happening, but, uh, yeah, maybe. Okay, so the thing is, is that there's a lot of questions for me, like, an overloading amount of questions, so I'm just gonna try and speed run through all of them. No, he's not stronger than me. He's, like, miles unstronger than me. Yes, he's already done that. He's already done that before. He's already spent all my money on gummy worms. Yeah, that was fun. No, it wasn't, Luigi. I had to call the bank. They, I literally wanted a negative balance. That's how many gummy worms we bought. Uh, oh, yeah, you don't remember that part. Okay. Uh, well, the thing is, is that he wasn't actually that cool looking. Wait, what are they talking about? They're talking about when you were wearing all those cool clothes on the yes day. Oh yeah, that was pretty cool. No, it wasn't. You look like a jerk. Uh, yeah, I guess so. The stupidest thing he's ever done. 
I can't even say that, honestly. Like, the stupidest thing he's ever done is probably, uh, still live here. What is that supposed to mean, Matteo? Hey, man, I'm just saying, sometimes we don't really need a lunatic running around the house, especially with you and your gummy worms. Okay. Yeah, I've already recovered from my coma. What do you mean? Like, I'm perfectly fine. I know comas take time to recover, but I don't know. It wasn't really that crazy of a coma. What? Okay, how do you even miss Toad? Like, nobody here misses Toad. Do you miss Toad? No. 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 Yeah, nobody misses Toad. His voice is really crazy, and it's really ear-piercing. And now we have a comment that has a question for literally everybody, so let's just speed through this. My biggest secret that's the most embarrassing is one time when I was younger, I thought the urinal was an actual toilet. You can probably guess what happened next. Uh, I can try. <laughs> ah! Okay, give me like 20 more years of practicing and I'll get it down. No, I'm not really into rocks anymore. After my last relationship, I don't think I'm gonna try another rock for a while. Wait, wait what? What? Oh my god, wait! My hair is orange, like, like the color of fire! Ah! My hair's on fire! Well, the thing is, I don't really want to arrest people. I kind of have to because it's my job. But if there was one person in the world that I could arrest, it would probably be the CEO of YouTube because we all know about the stuff she's done. Okay, guess I can't make a joke like that around here. It wasn't really a joke, though. You're gonna have to ask a mathematician for this answer. It is a very large number. Because he's weak and he doesn't want to actually talk things out, he just wants to battle his way to get what he wants instead. He's so immature. And now it says, uh, can you sing The Rock's rap? Um, okay, I guess we could try. It's about drive! It's about power! We stay hungry! Uh, hey, speaking of hungry, does anyone here have $5? I want to go get some Wendy's. Oh, come on, Bows! You were supposed to sing the lyrics to the song! You ruined it! <sighs> okay, whatever. All right, from the top, it's about drive. Put in the hours! And take what's ours! Whoa! Good performance, guys! Yeah, I agree. I'm glad we actually managed to make that work. Uh, well, I think this one is pretty obvious. I'd probably rather be the richest person in the world because, first of all, if I was the richest person in the world, I'd be richer than the president. And second of all, I could probably pay my way into being a president. You know, I could just, like, pay the government and be like, hey, make me president, you know? And, like, is that possible? I don't know if it is, but... Yeah, being richer is better. And how long do I think it would take to solve a Rubik's Cube? Uh, I don't really know. I mean, it'd probably take like three years or something. Yeah, we could have honestly found out earlier, but that weird Rubik's Cube wouldn't let us. Oh god, now that you say that, Junior, my foot still actually really hurts from that. Oh god. My biggest secret is that my foot is probably broken. Like, I haven't went to the hospital yet, but it hurts a lot more than you guys think it does. My biggest secret is that I'm actually wearing two shirts. I'm wearing a different shirt under this green one. Uh, guys, you kind of misread the question. It says, what are our secrets about each other? Anyways, my secret about each other is that dad was actually skinny at one point in his life. I know, it's surprising, right? Junior, why do you keep on targeting me? Anyways, my biggest secret about each other is that at one point, Junior was a stupid, dumb baby, and he was just, I, I, I hate Junior so much. That's, uh, that, that's my secret, is that Junior's kind of dumb. My biggest biggest secret about each other is that Yoshi isn't actually as smart as he seems. He actually gets all of his knowledge off of Wikipedia. <laughs> oh, Iggy, like you're some kind of mad scientist. My secret about each other is that that's actually Iggy's cover-up for the fact that he gets all of his knowledge off of Wikipedia. Man, talk about using unverified sources for your knowledge. Well, hey, shut up, uh, four eyes! Iggy, I'm not even gonna explain why that joke doesn't work here. My secret about each other is that Bowser has actually been arrested three times for shoplifting. Well, hey, I just wanted some Chips Ahoy, okay? Those things are awesome! And I don't really want to pay the price for them, so... Yeah! What are you talking about? Luigi's never been smarter than me in my life. I think you need an eye doctor, or you need to get your ears fixed or something. Oh, look at Maddio being insecure once again, because he just doesn't want to admit that I am superior in smart. Luigi, that was really bad grammar, and that proves my point even more. He's not smarter than me. Well, hey, 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 we don't say that word in this house, okay? We don't say, uh, Sonic. Uh, uh I'm not Sonic, I'm Tails. <sighs> Get out of my house, Sonic! I don't ever want to see you around these parts! You make me sick! Uh, again, I'm not actually Sonic, I'm Tails, but okay, I'll see you later. There won't be a later because I'm tired of you cheating! Oh my god, I hate Sonic so much! Uh, Maddio, that wasn't Sonic. <sighs> yes, it was, Luigi. I know who I was talking to! Alright, now time for the final question. Uh, are we ever planning on doing story arcs on this channel? Uh, well, personally, I've always wanted to do some kind of a story arc. Wait, what's going on? Program terminated. Channel is on lockdown.